The police searching for the person who opened fire during a drive-by, killing a young man. Tonight, family and friends held a vigil in his memory. 7 Action News reporter Alan Campbell is live where that drive-by happened on Cashew near Moraine. Alan, what's the family saying tonight? Devastated, clearly. Well, Dave, yeah, the Carpenter family is still in shock and awe. They can't believe someone took a family member from them so carelessly and senseless. And tonight they say they want whoever opened fire, killing 18-year-old Damon Carpenter to be found and brought to justice. He ain't deserve this at all. Period. Friday, December 22nd is a day the Carpenter family and friends will never forget. He just happened to be in the wrong place at the wrong time. 18-year-old Damon Carpenter shot during a drive-by killing him. He got killed like he was out here beefing or selling drugs or doing something. He wasn't doing none of that. He was a college kid. The incident happened around 6 p.m. near the intersection of Kaju and Morang. The circumstances of exactly what happened are still unclear. I just want justice for my child. I really do. I really do. Come on, was a cheerleader at Western Michigan University. WMU Athletics Department releasing a statement saying they're saddened by his passing. The cheer coach said in part, quote, he brought a contagious smile and positive energy to the team. Our thoughts are with his friends and family. Mourners came out to remember the young man who was about to celebrate his 19th birthday on January 1st. He just an outstanding, wonderful kid. No problems at all with him. A young life taken far too soon. If it take 12 years from now, I'm still going to be there. Regardless, I'm going to be there. My son will have justice. And tonight, Detroit police continue to investigate this shooting. But if you have any information, you are urged to give them a call. Reporting live on Detroit's east side of Alan Campbell, Action News. Thank you, Alan.